So I just installed Spotify on my HP touchpad and uh, I'm going to give you a little run through of a uh, patch that I installed on top of it. Um, as you know the uh, Spotify um, version they have for the touchpad that is um, that you have to install yourself is only the mobile version that was on the pre. So we're going to uh, show you what um, somebody has hacked onto these as far as a uh, tablet overlay goes for Spotify. So real quick to start this up, here is um, the app. This is it started up. Um, you have it's a, you know a lot like your desktop version, but um, it's definitely tweaked to be uh, a tablet HD version. Um, I'll show you some of the little specs that you can go in through or the little options they have. Um, you know, your playlists are down here. Of course, your uh, you know your people that you can share with. Um, local files inbox starred here. It's all here that you would have, uh, be accustomed to, at least in your uh, desktop version. Um, I will note that this has to use the premium version because it is considered a uh, mobile app. So um, let's go ahead and uh, show the search feature. You got a little button down here that searches. Press there. And uh, this is actually very nice. Um, the author, who um, the name escapes me, but I'll put it in the description, um, has done an incredible job. It only works in landscape, but uh, it's so far it's incredible. Um, you're able to scroll through some suggested apps up here, or suggested tracks and albums. Um, keep keyboard keyboard out of the way. Um, here's some other top tracks. You know, full scrolling and everything looks real clean. Um, up here you tap and you search. So we'll type in Ratatat and uh, here's their albums uh, here. You scroll down, you've got their tracks here. Uh, click on an album. And then uh, then Keep in mind, this is very responsive. It, everything moves as fast as uh, as soon as you touch it. But this is a uh, touchpad that I have um, disabled the logging on. It is not, um, however, uh, overclocked or anything. And then you tap on a song, and it starts playing. And you can also tap here in the corner on the left hand side and it'll pull up a, uh, a nice little now playing menu, uh, screen. Here are the different songs you can scroll through. If you just swipe left or right it'll switch the songs. Uh, your pause here is at the bottom. Pause and play at the bottom. Uh, you can repeat and shuffle the, uh, the songs. And down here, you've got the uh, the back in your playlist button. Uh, we'll show you the playlists next. But um, this is, like I said, an incredible job on this. Um, and the guy, even when he was talking about when he made it in the forums, he said that, oh, you know, it's it's not perfect, but it's good enough for me. But um, I'll tell you what, it's. Uh, an incredible job, and the guy has uh, is definitely not giving himself enough credit. Uh, here is the playlists here. In typical Spotify fashion, it's just a long list of tracks um, that you can just. But you know, you can scroll through it here like normal. But the search function is going to be more uh, proper because there's way too many songs to be uh, scrolling through. Um, it looks like they have the offline option. I have not tested that. Um, but I will um, eventually and let you know again in the description. Uh, your people are here. These are all the people you can share with. And then um, you know your inbox. You've got your starred here. It's quite impressive on the uh, on the app front. And then wherever you are, you can always tap on the left hand screen and pull up your now playing. So that is the uh, the Spotify HD uh, tweak that um, whoever has made it 
um, has, and that's a little walkthrough for you. That way you can see if you really want it or not. It's legit. Um, it only, again, it only works in landscape mode. Because here, I'll show you what happens when you put it into portrait. Yeah. You put it in portrait. Let's see, it acts a little funky. So, um, but that is a known issue, and it's only, it's made to only run in portrait, or in, uh, landscape, which, you know, really is not a problem at all, especially since you're not on a tiny little emulated phone screen. So that is, uh, the Spotify, uh, HD tablet patch, and, uh, I loved it enough that I figured I'd go ahead and try to at least get something out there for it. Thanks, guys.